Hello, I'm Artifacts of Mars, and I'm just going to do a quick review of Emerson 7-inch, eight, supposedly 8 gigabyte Android tablet. Now here you see the stock photo, and they're showing you all these videos and stuff you can watch on it. I uh, bought this for my own purposes. I needed... I wanted to have some internet at work in case I needed it, in case I needed to look something up. I'm not much into apps and stuff, which is probably a good thing. Okay, uh, Emerson 7 inch HD tablet. Operating system, Android 5.1 Lollipop. Y-Core processor, 7-inch display, memory, 8 gigabyte internal. That is false advertising. It's got 5. And of course, they use a little asterisk. Well, <laughs> memory may vary. It's bullshit. That is bullshit. That is bullshit. Uh, it's got about 5. It's always less than the stated claims, but that's, that's pathetic. Micro SD slot. I don't know if I'll be uh, putting extra memory in or not, whether I want to spend the money on it. Camera and speakers. I did verify it has a camera. I haven't really used it. I had to take the plastic off the front of it first. Left that on there. Uh, charging cable. Here's the problem with the charging cable. It doesn't have any wall plug. It's weird. Yeah, you can plug it into your computer. That's the main thing right there. Uh, that's exactly what I did. Charge it up. I, I have other means. I have one of those... I bought a local store and I plugged it in using that and charged it. That worked just fine. So I don't want to race that on it, but remember if you buy this thing, there's no wall plug to uh, charge it up with. You just have the USB cable and I guess you're expected to put, plug it into your computer or something. So that's not a good thing right there. And, of course, the user guide. Now, what did Artifacts of Mars buy it for? Well, I said, you know, I bought it for uh, an information resource for work if I needed it. Here's what I found with this thing so far. It's fairly easy to use. I, I've uh, had it connected to... My computer and that has worked out just super. You can move files on and off it with relative ease. And the computer is Windows 10, it picked up on it immediately. It says Emerson 7 inch tablet, something like that. So, it connects very easily to the computer. Now, as for apps, if you're a big apps person and you have, you know, hundreds of apps on your machine, I got news for you, this has very few apps. I did get it integrated in my systems and got email put on and everything, so I'm all set on that. Like I said, my primary emphasis is just for an information resource. I see these people playing with their cell phones and playing all sorts of weird games. I'm going, come on. You know, I only need a cell phone for a phone and a timer. And I have MP3s on it. If I decide to put MP3s on this, then maybe. Then I'll have to upgrade the memory. I didn't think the sound was very good, to be honest with you. I'm going to have to listen to it without earplugs. There's a lot of traffic outside, and 
and normally wear earplugs to kind of slow that down and kind of mute some of that out. I'd say if you just want something light, you know, like for, like for taking it into McDonald's to need to check on email and that type of thing, check stocks, well, as long as you're not logging in with a password, you'll be fine. It doesn't, it doesn't seem to have any other way that you can go online with it other than Wi-Fi. Very uh, thin tablet. Very responsive. Just lacking in a few uh, categories like you know, the memory. So uh, that's my review of the machine. I'm not going to return it to the store because it's going to fill my needs personally. Whether it fill yours depends on the individual. I'm Artifacts of Mars. Thanks for watching.